When looking at doing the visual inspection of this camshaft, again, it's the camshaft out of the ISX-15, what we can see on the surface of this camshaft is some discoloration. Now, some of this discoloration may just simply be oxidization because of the um, either infrequent oil change intervals or the amount of acid that this engine has been sort of exposed to, whether that's uh, moisture content in the oil due to uh, cold burning combustion so we don't get the engine to operating temperature. Uh, extended service intervals allows the etching to take place. So some of the discoloration may actually be from the exposure to the dirty oil. But another thing that is very common for us to see, and you can see it around the camshaft, not necessarily right on the lobe surface or right on the bearing surface, but beside it where we don't have the bearing surface. So right beside it on the support, we see a little bit of discoloration. So a little bit of bluing, that is very common. That is the coloring that happens when the manufacturers surface harden or case harden the camshaft. Now we case harden or surface harden the camshaft so that there is a very hard, smooth bearing surface that the rollers or the bearings can ride on. Now, we only want to harden the surface and not the entire camshaft all the way through its cross section because it needs to be able to handle the torsional loads that come from the springs acting against the lobes at different times. This is how we get the timing of our engine, the valves opening at the correct time. So as we look at a camshaft, as we look at any of our shafts inside the engine, it is very common for us to see some bluing, near or beside the bearing surfaces and that would come from hard surfacing. That's part of the manufacturing process. Now there are times where you will see a lack of lube or a starving of engine oil at the contact surfaces of our bearings. When that's true what you will see is that the bearing surface as well starts to turn blue. When that happens then you know you're no longer in the normal operating condition of that component, but instead you are now running in an overheat condition, which is likely caused by a lack of lubrication. That is either going to be a lack of oil in the engine, a starved uh, component as in contamination has blocked the passageway in the head or in the block and prevented the oil from getting to the bearing surface. So when we see coloration, on the main shaft but it's not on the bearing surface that's quite normal that is normal when we see discoloration or the bluing show up on the bearing surface and it's not nice and shiny and polished that's when we need to be concerned with a lack of lube failure